my side, Karate Illuminati, this is Noah, and today we're going to talk a little bit about two small surface strikes, uh, specifically Ipong Ken, that would be single point fist techniques. And we're going to take a look at, first of all, Keiko Ken, the Phoenix Eye Fist. Uh, this is the one that I start most of my videos with, and I recently posted a video working it on a maze bag. This works very well for linear strikes. And it's important to support your striking surfaces effectively for the techniques that you're using. So in this case, I curl the thumb in behind this knuckle. And that helps put support behind it. You can also have your thumb extended to accomplish the same thing. Some styles put it on top, but this does not provide any support beneath the knuckle in the direction of the pressure that you're going to be taking on. So it's not really very effective structurally. Now, the other one we're going to look at is Nakadaka Ipon Ken, Ryu Ken, Oni Ken, uh, depends on the su uh, system, what they call it. Uh, this one, people often try to use straight, but it works better in a circular motion, because really you can't put a lot of support beneath it for straight strikes, but it is supported along the back of the finger. So it works well to dig in circular strikes up under the jaw or into the body, while this one works quite well for being a little more. 